it means thin. Nice. So this right here was one of the beams that I had. You can tell it's definitely got a good bow to it and then it's also got a good twist going on there. And I had that one in the middle there and it was not, it was like level through here where she's at. But then on this side where I had this high side, it was all messed up. So what we ended up doing is just grabbing a new one. I'll find some sort of use for this thing. And we were able to get it leveled so she's already hard at work we're gonna start putting together the joists you ready yeah. all right let's go all right let's take a minute and look at the plans this is basically the vision what's going on here but right now we're gonna focus on the framing uh, what we're using is two by eight lumber uh, pressure treated and we're doing that in a 16 inch on center uh, setup. Um, I like to over engineer things. I know this is just a play structure, but it's just the way I do it. We did add a, uh, some more uh, beams and posts, posts and beams, but you'll notice there's like a double joists here and doubles on the rims around the outside. We'll go over that a little bit later, but let's just get started on setting up this uh, flooring framing. Okay, so for layout, we'll pull off the outside edge here. And we'll measure over 15 and a quarter. And then we'll make the X on the uh, right. And that'll put the center of the joist at 16 on center. And then an easier way to, to do it from here is put a nail in and you'll notice I put it on the edge of the line there and then just hook that measure 16 inches and put your X on the right and just continue that down or 24, whatever your layout is.
are you doing? Toenailing. Toenailing? Yep. What does that mean? Putting in a nail at an angle. Toenailing? It all takes practice. If you keep practicing, you'll be pretty good at it. So that's why you're teaching me how to um, make a play structure yeah. like this? Yeah. Oh, so the water slide? There's a water slide now? Yeah. 